Reset squad position. Okay, now he's got me held up about five, five inches above his head in a completely rigid state. This is... I'm gliding. I feel like the front of a ship. I feel like the little... the mermaid on the front of a ship. Oh... This is Bart. He's a cute little most terrifying bug monster I've ever seen in my life. And this is his bone dog named Bone Dog. In the last video, I traveled across the desert to get to Bug City, a safe haven for creepy bugs like me. After a long and dangerous journey, I found out that these guys hate me. Get out! Wait, what? Apparently I'm a different type of bug person called a fog man, and they don't get along so well with the other bug people. So in this video, I attempted to find a new place to call home. I looked in the direction that seemed the friendliest, and I set off, and immediately I found the cannibals. Turns out cannibals will eat bug people and people people, so that sucks. This was live streamed, so if you like the videos, come check out the streams. And if you don't like the videos, stay far away from the streams. All right, I want to make some money. I'm going to go into Darkfinger because that sounds cool. And I'm just going to try to see if we can find some money. I don't necessarily want to do anything to make money. I just want to I want to come into some money. Guys, there appears to be a little campsite over here. One sec, going to investigate. Guys, it's fine, everybody chill. Oh my god, you guys are so jumpy. It was just a, fa a small family of goats. Nothing to be freaked out about. <laughs> Scared by goats. I thought it was hound dogs, dude. I thought I was about to get ripped to shreds. You can never be too careful out here in this wacky wasteland. Did you see the way those goats were looking at me? They had intent to kill those things. Oh, well, hello. Oh my god, look, the goats must have come from here. This guy's got like 40 hundred million goats. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, last count, like twelve, maybe. Lots of goats here. Let's see if we can buy a goat from this guy. What can I do for you, traveler? You have anything to trade? <laughs> Just goats. Let's see how much. Twelve. Okay, guys, listen. This is like this is like the Gucci of goats. We need something more along the lines of like, we need like a ripoff, like a knockoff brand goat. I don't have enough money for any of these, dude. The cheapest goat they've got is like 7,000, and even then, this thing just looks kind of terrible. Okay, listen. I will be back. If you can just save me one goat. Can I put a goat on layaway? My chat room really wants a goat. You don't understand how much this would mean to me if you gave me one of these goats for free. <laughs> you don't understand. I really want one of these goats. Guys, okay, unfortunately, I don't think we're going to be getting a goat just yet. But, there's always the future. Um, our future's looking bright. Alright, the current objective, guys. We're gonna go check out Darkfinger. I think good things are coming from that way. I'm feeling positive. Oh, we're coming up on a camp! Oh, we're traveling, tra traveling travelers, guys! Hey! Hey! Oh, they're townie. I have animals for sale. Oh, more animals. Alright, guys, if we can maybe find a small animal, like a chipmunk or like a... maybe a beaver. Oh, god. Two th wait, 2,000! What is this thing? This is gross. They have another bone dog. Do you guys want another dog? Wait, that other dude was ripping me off. Look at these goats. These goats are so cheap. Okay, yeah, let's buy another bone dog. Everybody say hello to the newest member, Goat. He's just a pup, but he'll grow up one day. Wait, I gotta get these guys some food. I didn't even consider that now we have more mouths to feed. Oh, brother. Let's see. See that the dark lands over there? This is called Dark Finger. And that's where we're headed. We're getting close. Look, guys, a cute little encampment. Let's see if there's any... Cannibal cooking pit. Guys, bad news. I think Darkfinger might be cannibal territory. All right, let's try to just get to the next camp. This place is giving me the creeps. Look at all these guys! Look at these! Wait, who killed him, though? What's he doing? <laughs> little frogman. Alright, try to shoot him. Watch. Who am I shooting now? 
Oh my god, they're coming out of the hills! Run! Alright, they're catching up. I don't know why I came over here, to be honest with you. It's just one or two, so it won't... Oh. Where am I headed? Village. I gotta get to this village so someone will help me. Guys, yeah, my review of Darkfinger, just not a great... Not a great place to be. Don't come here. There are cannibals all over the place. Oh. Oh. Bone dogs. Oh, thank you. My hero. Oh. <laughs> oh, where are you taking me? <laughs> Um, so guys, those weren't my saviors at all. I think they were just a different tribe of cannibals. Yeah, the bigger cannibals came. <laughs> What's that? What are you gonna do to me? Ow. My head hurts. Can you put me down? Let's see where they take me. Yeah, I think, guys, I think they're gonna rescue me. This is... This guy can't make up his damn mind. If he puts me in a cage, then I'm gonna pick my way out. Oh, there's one, my dead dog. Cute. Yeah, I did lose both of my, my beautiful dogs, but the good news is I still have got my beautiful life, and that is, you know, that's important to me. Look at his big old feet. Let's fast forward while this guy figures out what he wants to do. He's going to get hungry at some point. Maybe I have to reload the, uh... There's a way to, one sec, reset squad position. Okay, now he's got me held up about five five inches above his head in a completely rigid state. This is... I'm gliding. I feel like the front of a ship. I feel like the little... the mermaid on the front of a ship. Oh... Yeah, I'm like a kite. I'm catching air. Like, this is a beautiful, beautiful imagery here. <laughs> oh... Come on! Take me to where we're going! Let's, um... Let's exit, and then I'll restart the game. Alright, let's wait and see. Is he st- what the hell? Huh, a hallucination, mayhaps? While you're doing this whatever stuff, can you please say a few words of remembrance for Bone Dog and Goat? Yeah, guys, let's go find Bone Dog and Goat, if possible. Um, they died somewhere around here. Up oh, here. I think this might be their little muddy, muddy gut prints on the ground here. Yeah, so if you guys want to bow your head and like, you know, uh, maybe, maybe like, give a kiss to each of these puddles here I, I don't know how you uh how you mourn the loss of a loved one but if you want to scoop some of that up and take it home with you you feel free <laughs> but yeah they are gone these guys are still just i'm i'm pretty much at the mercy of whatever this guy wants to do let's keep going maybe i'll wake up from my recovery coma and then things will start happening wait something something cool's happening over at the cannibal camp guys you see that Oh look, these are my new roommates, I think. Everybody, hey, meet the squad. What's up, everybody? Let's see what else we've got going on over here. Why do they got people? What, are they gonna eat the other cannibals? Dude, you know what? It would be just not fun to live in a cannibal community. You mess up and then all of a sudden you're on the menu. Whoa, what the f is happening? A cannibal civil war. Oh. oh. What ha- What are y'all doing? Gentlemen, you're gonna hurt me. Gentlemen, gentlemen, put me down if you're gonna fight. You're gonna hurt me. Wait! This could be huge. What if this cannibal knocks this cannibal's head off and then I can run away? Okay, he's down. Come on, come up. Oh, not looking good. Oh, I'm really rooting for this guy, but he's not looking too capable here. Okay. Our champion has been defeated. <laughs> Maybe that broke his AI loop? Yeah, I hope so. Yeah, let's see. 
Oh my god, yeah, he's sort of like doing other stuff now. Guys, I think this is it. I think we're going to live with this guy. Hopefully he's got a two-bedroom, two-bath, a pretty big apartment in a nice neighborhood. Oh, we're going to this camp. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. I don't see cages here, guys. I just see some spikes. Oh, brother. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> let's, let's look at our options here. My run speed is 20 miles per hour. These little idiots run at 16 miles per hour. What I'm imagining is I bust out of here and then I just run, run for the hills. All right, I'm gonna try to bust out of here, guys. I wonder if they'll be able to see me picking the lot. I gotta be ready to run. If I get out of this, I gotta be ready to sprint. Come on. Come on. The second I'm out of this, guys, I'm running for the hills. They have no idea. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to bust out. They can't hear a thing. It's successful. I can leave at any point. All right. Here's what we're gonna do. Let me double check and make sure everybody's run speed is slower than mine. 16, 16, 16, 2. What is your run speed so slow for? Leg injury. I think you got an arm injury as well, my friend. You don't not looking healthy here. All right. Before we leave, let's plot our course. We know now that Dark Finger sucks. Wait, there's villages over here. Guys, these might be peaceful. No, this place is probably all cannibals. Let's be real. Let's be honest with each other. I need to get I need to get out of Dark Finger, okay? I think we need to get back to Sincoon and then maybe go through Great Desert down this way or go like along the coast this way. I think let's do that. We'll go along the coast, all right? So in which case I need to be running this way. Okay. Let's do this. Oh my god, I thought he was running up to <laughs> okay, we're good. Go, go, go! Alright, we're out of here. Ladies and gentlemen, we're free! Let's see where we're headed. We're on, we're on the right track. I'm gonna do a quick little look around behind me to see if they're still following me. Oh, they, they are so slow. If they're back there, I can- oh, There is one still- oh, Don't stop, you little moron! Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, we lost our dogs, unfortunately, but guys, I mean it when I say I'm gonna get an even better dog. Oh, they are slow as all hell. This little guy's got hustle! Dude, yeah, I started the second I got out. I started pumping these legs as quick as they could make me go. Look behind. Oh. Brother, this is embarrassing. They're gonna starve to death before they catch me. They've got no chance. I'm so quick. Oh, don't stop. Don't stop, though. Guys, you want to know an embarrassing story? I think it's been a long enough since I've told my last embarrassing story that I can share one today. <laughs> you guys are going to make fun of me. But I'll share. <laughs> if you promise, if you just promise that you'll laugh and be that you'll think it's funny. I understand that I'll be made fun of, but that's a risk I'm willing to take. All right, one time, one time I was running late for school and I was like, I didn't have any clean clothes and I was like, damn it. I'll just rewear this pair of jeans, it's fine. And so I'm like halfway through the school day, I'm walking down the hall and I feel, that's hilarious, that's not the, that's not the funny part yet. I'm walking down the hallway. Why are you saying ew? You don't even know what it's going to be. Uh, I'm walking down the hallway and I feel something in my pants leg. And I, uh, I like pull it out and it's a pair of underwear <laughs> from, from when I was wearing the pants previously. <laughs> so I had this pair of underwear in my pants all day, dude, in my pants leg. And uh, I pulled it out, and I think I threw him away because I was so, I was like petrified. I was mortified. I think I went to the bathroom and threw him in the trash. Are those cannibals still chasing me? Or we oh my god, they're so much closer than I thought! The 
poor janitor? What do you mean the poor janitor? I, they weren't like shit. They weren't shit underwear. They were just normal underwear. But I'm not gonna carry around a pair of underwear. I threw them in. I didn't even throw them on the floor or anything. I put them in the trash can. Oh my god, they're still chasing me. These guys just won't give up. Oh, a city. Hopefully they're peaceful. Oh, I think I'm being protected. Oh my god, protect me, gentlemen, please protect me. These cannibals want- they, these cannibals will ha see me dead, please. Yeah, not so tough now, are you, you little piece of shit, now that me and my friends are here, huh? You know what? I'll be taking your head. And then I'll be putting it right back on. I just pulled his head off for sport. That was pure sport. Hey, don't mind me, guys. I'm just kidnapping this cannibal that you killed for me. Thank you. Hey, don't worry. I'll make his life hell. Well, they're knocking me away. All right, let's loot him. Let's throw his weapon on the floor. Take all this. Take his teeth. I'm not taking his head because I... Oh, guys. Oh, fuck. Guys, apparently pulling all of someone's teeth out just on the spot with no medication or no tools kills them. He's dead. Well, you learn something new every day, ladies and gentlemen. Cannibal heads sell for quite a pretty penny. I'll take that. Maybe I can find somebody who doesn't like cannibals and I'll sell them all these heads. We gotta wait for this trading post to open. And you know what? I'm gonna stand right the hell here. I'm standing right here until it's open. Hmm. Yeah, I know. I'm stanced up. Oh my god, it's open! Hello. Were you just in here? He sleeps in here. This guy lives in here. Oh, yes. This guy's got $14,000, and that will all be mine. Alright. Sell this for how much? A couple hundred. Not much at all, but what about this little piece of cloth that I found? <laughs> Alright, guys. We're sitting pretty. We made, like, no money. Oh, my God. Wait. Idea. I'm going to loot. Yeah. Okay, chat. Oh, my God. Look at this beautiful loot. So we know this guy takes cannibal heads, he will take cannibal weaponry, take that. Dude, this is, we're living large, we're gonna have so much money. Alright. Hello little guy, what will you give me for all of these cannibal heads? Oh my god. $7,700, and I'm not even done yet. <laughs> I gotta take advantage of this. What happened to Bone Dog? Um, Bone Dog actually had to go uh, to a business meeting, so he'll probably be back later this afternoon. He said don't wait up for him though, so... Alright, I've got like $10,000 almost. Alright, let's see what else this town has to offer here. Let's trade with this guy here. Barrel, shirt, bread, mmm, yummy. You know what? I'll buy the hat. Oh, yeah! Oh, my forehead's sticking out the top of it. Guys, this is humiliating. Guys, where is our next stop? Let's see. I kind of want to go through into the Dead Cat Plains. And just explore along the coast. The bar might have allies. Yeah, but all the allies, the thing about the allies is they're just not real friends. They just want money. Like, look at this. This guy's going to say, You have any idea how hard it is to run a farm when there's a goddamn horde of cannibals licking their lips and waiting to devour you from over the hill? Guess how many farmers have died in the last week? Thanks to those barbaric animals. Just take a guess. Uh, I have no idea. Everyone gave up keeping count long ago. We found out about seven chewed up remains in the hills this week alone. Whether those body parts were from the same person or whether they were from seven different corpses, I'll be damned. I need to leave, but I can't set up alone. I need a fellow settlers to start over with. Gah! Wait! Guys, I think we just found a guy who wants to join us for free. You're welcome to join me. I could use the skills of a farmer. That's great news. I I'll need an advance of 2,000 cats first. Guys, they want money. Okay, fine. Green finger. Let's change our idle stance, because this is too awkward, dude. This is how I stand. The rat. Alright, this is good. I'm happy with this. Alright, green finger, welcome to the gang. Welcome to the club. Let's see what your stats are here. Farming, 40! Guys, we've got... A farmer. I'm a, I kind of want to check out Dead Cat Plains, guys. That sounds pleasant. 
Come on, let's go. Off into the distance. This is gonna be this is gonna be awesome. You guys are gonna love Dead Cat Planes. Insert journey music. Yeah, we need like a good soundtrack. Something really theme appropriate. For the <laughs> Yeah, this is badass. Yeah, dude. We need to bring dubstep back. Travel montages. Everybody loves a good travel montage. I just ate a piece of raw meat. Mm. All right. Back to the ambience. Oh look, this is a, another village. Let's go on in. Through this hole in the wall. Hello? Wait, can... Wait, this place is locked down. Hello? Wait, this isn't considered stealing. Did I find a ghost town? Legend says that four days ago, this used to be a bustling community. But then the ghosts came and turned this place into a ghost town. There used to be 13 people that lived here. And now not a single one is left behind. Sometimes if you listen really close, you can hear the sound of their cries. Tell me you heard that too. <laughs> we've got to get out of here. We've actually, no. Being honest with you, we've got to loot this place. This is incredible. I found an entire city that people don't live in. This is incredible. Pause the music. Chat, we might... Wait, what is this? The Holy Flame? I'll be having that. What is it? The Religious Book of the Holy Nation. Oh, this is trash. Let's start looting. Grog. <gasps> Grog? Grog and Grog. Huh. Their plants haven't decayed, which means that they left recently. Grog is worth a lot of money? No way. One sec. Guys, we're going to investigate the Grog. Let me go remember where that was. Wait, Grog, here it is. Wait, did you see this? Grog. Holy sh! <laughs> Guys, we are millionaires! Oh my god, we're millionaires! Hello? <laughs> Wait, he's Holy Nation? No, this guy might just be exploring the abandoned town just like me. Grog, more Grog. Look at- guys, I want you to look at how expensive this shit is. 1,500 Grog, 1,155 dollars. That's mine. Going straight in the bank. Wait, a little battle going on out here. Oh, bad news, ladies and gentlemen. I think I should steer completely clear of this area entirely. Maybe not. I mean, there's probably some good stuff out, like small outpost over here. All right, let's get out of this damn place. I'm scared. This pla Someone's going to come up here and take everything from us. All right, guys, let's try to get to this small outpost and see if it's peaceful. And we can sell all of our loot. Check out the fight. Uh, they're still over there, and there's more, even more people passing by. Guys, these are like, these are freaky. Wait, they're coming towards me. Holy sh! Wait. 
Oh my god, they're coming right towards me! Oh my god! <laughs> it's... What do we do? What do we do? They're gonna take my grog. They're gonna take all my grog, dude. I'm not ditching the grog. I'm not ditching the grog. Oh my god. We gotta ditch the grog, guys. Oh my god. Take off everything that's not- Oh, this is so unfortunate. Okay, these guys can run 15 miles an hour, 13 miles an hour, 14 miles an hour. So I just gotta ditch enough to where I run 16 miles an hour. Ditch the hat. We're gonna split our grog stash in half. Okay. I can run 17, they can run 20. Chat room? Whoop! Um, 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 um. What is it? What is it? Green finger, no! <laughs> this is so dumb. I'm turning the music off. That was just a joke. I don't listen to dubstep, guys. Okay, I'm gonna take them back to the city that's safe, I think. I'm gonna lure these guys so that they die. Are they even chasing me? We really booked it out of there, holy smokes. I wouldn't be surprised if I actually atomized everything behind me in my path, because I broke the sound barrier. Alright, well we got- we- we lost them. Thank goodness. They gave up pretty quick. I'm gonna try to bandage up old Greenfinger here. We gotta watch our surroundings though. Any sign of movement, and I am booking it. I'm like a deer, or an antelope. My eyes are on the side of my head. You can buy a nice hat with the grog money? Dude, hell yeah! Chat, I'm about to be able to buy any hat I want. I can I can buy any hat on the damn planet. Walked over a corpse. All right, let's sell this grog. All the doubters, dude. They don't even have enough money to buy all my grog. They don't even have enough money to buy all my grog, dude. On to the next shopkeeper. I'm gonna have so much money by the end of this. I don't even want to look until I've got it all. All right, let's do it. Final test. Oh, <gasps> chat room. My sweet, sweet chat room. Direct your direct your gaze to the bottom right. Twenty-six thousand dollars, almost twenty-seven. I can buy. I can buy like a. I can buy a Tesla. Oh my god. Oh, this is huge. Okay, save game. I'm the richest, bitchest bug on the planet. 